Welcome back, gang. Professor Chafin here. We're going to be filming Exless Procedures utilizing this beautiful machine. If you guys do not know, it actually dissipates fat cells and tightens skin. However, it has a few different settings. It has cool setting and it uses thermodynamics for the radio frequency. So depending on what you want to accomplish, if you want a more tightening effect of the skin, you would make it colder. And then when, the, when you rub the probe over the skin, it would attract the heating component to the coldness and that tightens up the skin. If you want more fat cell dissipation to burn fat, then you would actually turn up the temperature, so not as cold, and turn up the energy setting with radio frequency to burn more of the fat cells and then they would just urinate it out. So today, uh, one of our patients have signed a consent form for us to film her. We're actually going to be working on the buttocks today. This will be on the YouTube channel. It will be on Instagram, Facebook. So we're going to be filming that, providing that out to you guys. And we just want you to comment. Tell us how we can improve, what you guys want to see from us here in the clinic and the school. Because we also have the school, got the clinic. It's good for our students because they have a real world uh, situation here. So there's nothing fake about here in this clinic, this is real with real patients. So uh, it's kind of like me when I when I practice with my bow and arrow, I stop practicing with field points. I actually practice with broadheads. It just because when the moment of truth comes, I'm ready. Phone's ringing, so better get it. Be sure you click like and subscribe on our channel, guys. Appreciate it. Welcome back, guys. Uh, so we have a patient today here. Our lovely patient Tasha has agreed for us to film today. We're actually going to be working on the uh, right buttocks and left buttocks areas. Uh, I think some of you women refer to them as saddlebags, so uh, on the sides as well. And I don't know if you guys know this at home, but we use, and the doctors that train me on this machine, train me to use Pond's cold cream. You apply it to the skin before an exless treatment, and you may be thinking, why do they do that? It's because that Pons has an ingredient, the doctors taught me, candela wax. Candela wax, we thought was wax from a candle because you think center on candela laser company, but it's actually uh, a wax from the candeliate plant that grows in like southern New Mexico and on the, in parts of Mexico. So we're going to apply that to our buttocks this in area, this area. Right through here. And then um, yeah, you can like see, that, yeah, in this area. So we'll do figure eight on this side, figure eight on the other side with the axis, and you can see with the ponds, it melts it like into a butter, really tightens the skin, but this is going to be more of fat cell dissipation because the energy setting will be a little bit high, higher. We're going to focus less on cooling. So stay tuned, guys. Appreciate it. Hello, we're back here. Um, Allison uh, with my friend Tasha. We are doing the axis treatment on her. Tasha has lost quite a bit of weight. Um, she has lost like over 70 pounds. Is that right, Tasha? Mm -hmm. And uh, she works out and does all the wonderful things you're supposed to do while having exless treatments done to help with the process. So we are putting the Pond's cold cream on this area. See, we're going to work here on what a lot of people refer to as the saddlebags. And we will be back. We have before pictures and after. Now, uh, FDA recommendations that, or recommends per se, that you have, or she have four treatments in this area. So we're gonna do the left side and then the right, and we will have progress reports as we go. See you soon, stay tuned. So when you have an area where you have more adipose tissue, it takes longer, a little bit longer to heat up. So like if I was doing around her love handle for her rib cage here, where it was, um, it would heat up faster and it would hurt her faster. Like a lot of people on the back of the thighs, on the um, saddlebag, it just feels like a hot stone massage. Don't you think, yeah, Tasha? It doesn't it hurt. hurt. It's not like to the point. And it takes longer, so we got to get up to 40 degrees Celsius. So it's taken us over three and a half minutes and we're almost there, as you can see. And see how she's getting pink. And that's what you want. So the setting that I'm using um, does melting and tightening both. You can melt, you can tighten, or you can do both. Or if you want to 
more of the time than the fact you've got to turn down the temperature to make it cold. So the, it's more concentrated on the surface of the right. epidermis? Right, it, it attracts more, and so it exactly, okay. attracts more. Okay, guys, so we had the skin heated up to 40 degrees and that 40 degrees Celsius, that uh, efficiently dis will dissipate the fat cells. She drank plenty of water before coming in. She'll drink plenty of water to, uh, tonight, today, tomorrow, and it, can, it will continue to work throughout the week where she will urinate uh, out. When the, when the fat cells melt in the body, you actually urinate it out. So uh, hopefully this patient... We'll, re we'll have some, some uh, good results, and be sure you click like and subscribe on our channel, guys. Appreciate it. So also with this patient, guys, uh, we've been treating the um, chin area. She actually had some um, sagging skin um, under her chin. And a little, there was a little bit of um, fat build up around the chin, but she's actually had how many treatments? Two. So she's had two treatments with the skin. Um, and then we'll try to post some pictures before, but as you can see, she's got really good results. And what we're going to do today is do uh, another treatment on the chin. So with Exilus, you can have one treatment per week on one area. I don't think I would do um, the same area twice in, in, a, in a week. I mean, you probably could do that, but you run the risk of possible burning and scarring. Uh, it's best to let the skin heal from being heated up to that temperature because you have to heat up 40 degrees Celsius. So anyway, um, we're going to use uh, the Exilus again, and this is the smaller handheld piece. And it's got a little blue beam on it. Yeah, this is a smaller piece, and the treatment's actually quite comfortable uh, for the patients. It's again heating up the skin to tighten, increase the collagen elasticity, and to dissipate fat cells. Okay, guys, back again, and just want to thank Miss Tasha here, our patient, for um, letting us film her in this procedure. And maybe if you just tell us, like, what your goals are, what and the results, you know, with Exodus, I appreciate it. Yeah, no, I started um, dieting and doing keto lifestyle almost two years ago. Um, I had three kids, and it was massive. Some women do really good with patients. It wasn't me. Uh, so my skin stretched, but I lost. I would like the skin tightened up, and I'd like the stretch marks reduced, and uh, and not just on my stomach, but just down my chin. After I lost weight, my skin on my chin was just very kind of loose. You could see the fine three lines where the skin was hanging. It was didn't have the fat in there to keep it nice and plump anymore. <laughs> <laughs> so with my first Bacillus treatment, I was down to two lines. With my next one, I was hoping to be down to no lines. Yeah. So I mean, it's been so it's working for you. It's been amazing. Yeah. So. Anyway, guys, so that's that's the point she was. So not only the excellence, but she's implementing dieting and and, and, I your, run. and you exercise. I do. So that's what I tell my patients is if you start with excellence, it's good that you uh, diet, exercise, have all these, drink plenty of water, have all these positive things going on in your life. It'll just work better if you do that. Yeah, and then Tasha is an example of that. So Tasha, appreciate you letting us film you oh, I, the procedure. We'll try to put some before and after pics on, on our YouTube and on our website of uh, your chin. Yeah, yeah you'll chin. get, yeah. I'm six inches down on my stomach. And six inches, wow. <laughs> six inches down on her stomach. So, and then I know sometimes the plastic surgeons have to do surgery on the stomach, you know, you know, post, um, when you give birth. After, yeah. Yeah, after the and birth. And I'm not against that, but yeah. I wanted to do this first. If I could go in it, yeah, in, yeah. Okay, because I didn't want to have 
Yeah, if you can go non-invasive with the stomach and accomplish the same goal, because I have actually referred patients out that I felt like they were a candidate for plastic surgery. Because the plastic surgeons here in Lexington, but Tasha, you're not. I don't think you're a candidate. Yay. So, it's helping you. <laughs> it is. It's amazing. Yeah. I think you guys are awesome. Well, thank you. I appreciate that. We love all of our patients. love our students here. Be sure you click like and subscribe, guys, and thank you. Thank <laughs> you.